if I'm only interested in deleting the file, if the file exists, then I can check with io.file.exists function to see if the file exists. If file exists, I will display the message file exists, and then I'll delete it. Otherwise, I'll, sh I'll display the message file does not exist. So when I test this application, since I already have the file created, if I click and check, the first time it runs, it says file exists. So it must then delete it. Let me click the button again. This time, since I'm expecting the file to be deleted, it must display file does not exist. And that's exactly what it does. That means the file was deleted.